Hello YouTube, welcome to another one of my videos, and this time um, I'm here to show you my uh, homemade uh, TV oscilloscope. I had an old black and white TV, portable black and white TV lying around, so I decided to to uh, turn it into an oscilloscope. So uh, let me power it on here. Okay, <laughs> don't want to leave it sitting still with a line for too much too long. Cause I've already burned a line into it. So, uh, <laughs> so here is a 440, 140 um, hertz sine wave. You need to adjust that. There's the sine wave kind of a weird distortion or something over there in the corner. There's a four, 440 hertz uh, sine wave there. Might be able to hear the tone in the background. All right. Um, hold on, I'm gonna have to do something here. Here is a one, I believe a 100 hertz sine wave. It's supposed to be sine wave, so I'm going to adjust that to make it a sine wave there. Oops, too low. There we go. Here's a, well, it's a double sine wave, but it's still sinusoidal. So that's 100 hertz sine wave. You may not hear the tone. But there was a tone with that. No, wait. Yeah. No, the bottom one. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, that's uh, 100 hertz. Here's a... Here is a... Uh, I believe a 100 hertz uh, sawtooth. You can definitely hear that tone nice and crisp. It's another little wave there. But all that matters is that it shows a nice uh, wave there. Alright, move to my cathode ray tube here. Uh, that's good. Let's stop that. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna hook it up to some music, so hold on. <laughs> 